Hi guys, so today we are going to do a nice gentle reformer workout. So go ahead and set your springs up for two red and a blue. Get yourself comfortable on your reformer. You can have your headpiece up if you need support for your neck. Toes are gonna go on that foot bar in your Pilates V, roll those shoulders back, press the upper back down. You're in a nice neutral spine and exhale as you press, inhale as you come in. Making sure those knees are right in between your second and third toes. Chest is nice and open, heart is nice and open. Use that breath with the movement. Exhale as you press away, inhale to come gently down. Two more, lengthen, elongate, and gently come down. Wrap your arches and go into your birds on a perch, feet together, knees together, point those toes over that foot bar. Your arches are right above those heels. Exhale, inhale down. Keep growing tall as the carriage comes down. You got three more. Back and forth with control. Nice. Open up those heels to a nice wide frog and flex those feet, pull those toes back, press that carriage away and gently release down with control. Exhale and inhale back and forth. Keep the upper back down and keep that tailbone down and nice and heavy. Get some weight on that carriage with that lower back. Two more. Beautiful. You're lengthening the legs without locking the knees. And gently come in, go into a pigeon toed position. Knees and thighs might come together at the base. If they don't, that's okay. If it's too much on the knees, go into a nice parallel position. Exhale, press, inhale, come down. You got two more, beautiful, one more, and gently release. Let your legs stay wide. You can grab the shoulder pegs and rock side to side, or if you wanna open your arms out T. Rotate the head towards the opposite of the knees if you wanna add that extension in that spiral rotation and add that upper neck. Make sure to even yourself out and come gently back to center. Headpiece is gonna go down underneath you. Legs are gonna stay nice and wide. And we're going to articulate up one vertebra at a time. And then articulate down upper back, middle back, lower back, tailbone. Exhale, press up, rolling with control and gently release down. One more, rise up, exhale, peel. Palms can stay where they're at or you can lace those fingertips together, stretch away from the center of the body, press and bring that carriage in. You're not in your highest bridge. Your tailbone is dropped down a little bit. The chest is open. You got two more, exhale, press, inhale in. One more, press, and gently come in. Release the arms, lower down. Walk those legs hip width apart. Really get onto those heels, and now you're gonna hinge the hips up, hinge down. Exhale, move up in one piece, inhale at the top, exhale down. Again, exhale up, inhale down, one more. Stay up, open the arms out, hug your tree, release the arms. Hug your tree again, release the arms, press the carriage away, exhale, hug your tree. And again, lengthen, elongate, bring that carriage in, two more, pressing out with control, bring it in with control, one more, exhale, inhale, gently come in, roll down, one vertebra at a time. Palms come down by your sides. Walk those toes to that foot bar. 
stretch your legs out and go into that Pilates prancing, rolling through those feet, energy throughout those feet, and then start to pick up the pace going into that run. Should feel yummy, back and forth with control. Go into that tendon stretch, lower to three, lift to three, lower to three, lift again. Nice strong ankles, two more, abs are engaged, chest is open, and let that carriage come in. Beautiful. Legs are going to go over that foot bar, reach your arms up, tuck your chin in, peel up, and let's change our spring. You're going to go to one blue spring, get to your knees into that tabletop position. Knees are going to go against those shoulder blocks. Palms are going to go right over that frame of the reformer. Walk your hands a little further up. Scoop your abs in and curl that pelvis under. Again, exhale, curl. Look between your knees and exhale, curl. Get a nice stretch in that lower back. Beautiful. Again, exhale, curl. Feels so good. Let's do two more. One more. And exhale. And gently release. Nice. Let the carriage come all the way back to the stopper. You're going to go into that wonderful position of your Cleopatra. Knees together. And let's go ahead and have your feet against that shoulder block. You're going to reach up and over. You're going to go ahead and take a nice stretch, reach down towards the well, and gently rise up with control. Again, reach down, take a big stretch, and gently come up. Chest is lifted. Beautiful. Two more. Into that Cleopatra. Gently come up. Exhale, one more. Get those grapes in your mouth and gently release. Arms are going to windmill. Reach for those shoulder blocks, scoop those abs in and take a counter stretch. Nice. Windmill the arms again towards that foot bar and exhale, press into the well and lift the chest up. Again, exhale, scoop the belly in, look towards the well, and gently rise up. One more, exhale, press, beautiful. And gently release up with control. Again, if that is too much on the knees, you can always have your legs come down to a bent position in front of you. Or you can always sit on top of your adjuster if you need to. Make sure to do the same thing to the other side. And get those legs towards the shoulder blocks. Feet go against that back shoulder block. Reach up and over and take that Cleopatra. And then come up. Again, exhale, Cleopatra. Big stretch, feels so good. Let's go for two more. Exhale, coming down, using your obliques to help you lift up. One more, release. Gently come up, windmill the arms towards the shoulder blocks. Counter stretch, scoop those abs in, stretch, stretch, stretch. Windmill the arms again towards that foot bar, square those shoulders, go down towards the well. And then take that back extension as you lift the chest up. Exhale, press, and gently rise up again. Down with control, shoulders down the back, rising up. One more. Exhale, reach, and gently rise up. Straddle towards the foot bar. Open up those legs. And then press that carriage back. Exhale, scoop the belly button up and in and lift the chest up. 
Beautiful. Again, scoop those abs in, take a nice little counter stretch and gently release up. One more exhale, scoop the belly button up and in and gently release. Nice. Legs are going to come in. They're going to go nice and wide on that foot bar. Get yourself comfortable. Hands go on the inside of the legs and stretch. Lower the heels down, lift the heels up, bend the knees. Again, exhale, stretch, lower, lift, and up. Grab the foot bar, center with that left hand, open that right arm out T, come back to center, and switch, and rotate, and back to center. If you need to, you can always let go of that foot bar. If it's too much of a stretch holding on to that foot bar, listen to your body. Take a nice stretch, fold down, relax. Nod the head, yes, and nod the head, no. Good job. Let that carriage come in and walk the legs in. Good. Let's go ahead and add on a red spring. So now we're gonna have a blue and a red, and let's get onto our backs and get our feet into our straps. Grab those straps, and now go ahead and extend your legs and place both feet into the straps. We're gonna go ahead and open up to that straddle. Let the heels come together. Open up to that straddle and heels together. Again, open two, three, release two, three. Your pelvis stays in one position, so if you feel your pelvis shifting, go ahead and keep that straddle smaller. Abs are engaged, shoulders are relaxed. You got it. Turn the legs parallel, and let's go ahead and circle with our legs in a parallel position. This feels so yummy. Reverse the direction, circle the other way. Going around, exhale, nice, beautiful. Heels are gonna go together, bend your knees to your chest, let your hips rise up, press the legs down, bend, exhale, rise up, press the legs down. Reverse the direction, lift up with control, bend the knees in and peel down, upper back, middle back, lower back, tailbone. One more time, exhale. You can always modify and keep your hips down if you need to. Grab the ropes, flex those feet, pull your legs towards you. Open up that right leg to the side. Open up that left leg to the side. Come back to center. Open up to that straddle. Get that nice little stretch. Feels so good. Let the legs come together. Go into your Peter Pan. Bend your knee in. Let the other leg go out to the side. Both legs come center. Pelvis stays nice and stable. Exhale energy throughout both legs. Fly away, pelvis is stable, abs are engaged. One more, exhale, open up to that straddle again. Go to your happy baby, bending those knees. You can take a little rock if you choose, beautiful. Come back to center. Grab those straps, let your legs come into a tabletop position, and you're going to circle those arms around. Exhale, circle, big scoop, beautiful, big scoop. Reverse the direction, shoulders go down the back, around, exhale, inhale, exhale. You got two more, nice, and last one gently release. Let the feet come down to that foot bar. Hang up your straps. Legs go over that foot bar. Use your abs to peel yourself up. Beautiful. 
and let's go ahead and do some back work. So go ahead and take off a blue spring. We're gonna be on one red, get to your knees. Again, if you need to modify, come off your knees. Grab where the metal buckles are and you're going to take a nice stretch back and come up again going back and up if it does not bother you to drop your head you can do so again make sure to tuck your chin in before you come up two more One more. And gently release. Good job. Step off your reformer. Go ahead and take a nice lunge. Press that carriage back. Enjoy that stretch. Feels so good. Exhale, take that rotation back to center and curl in again, rotate, bring that carriage in one more time, rotate and curl, switch outside arm on that reformer, take that rotation to the back knee, bring it in, go into that lateral flexion. And again, rotate, exhale, stretch one more time. Oh my gosh, it feels so good. And in, grab the foot bar with both hands and straighten that front leg. You can even rotate that front leg out and in if you choose. Enjoy that stretch. Rotate to the side, go into that adductor stretch. Walk your hands towards those shoulder blocks. Bring that carriage in. And one more time, stay nice and parallel. And bring that carriage in. Good job. Let's do the other side. So now take that lunge, knee right over that ankle, press that carriage back, bring it in. Again, exhale, press back, bring it in. Add that outside arm out as you rotate, bring it in, take a nice stretch. Again, rotate, beautiful, bring it in. One more, rotate, bring it in, and then switch arms. Take that rotation, bring it in, going into that lateral flexion, exhale, Bring it in, one more, exhale, bring it in. Nice, stretch that front leg out. You can even rotate that leg out and in if you choose. Let that carriage come in, rotate to the side, go into a nice flat back, stretch out. Let the carriage come in, walk your hands towards the shoulder blocks. Come in one more time, nice and flat back. Shoulders are square and bring it in. Very nice. Then we're gonna do foot bar all the way down. Lock it. Grab your box. And let's finish with some back extensions. All right, get onto your abdominals. Legs are as wide as your box. Lift that chest up, open up the heart, open up the collarbone, and then press back, look towards the well. Gently rise up and gently release back. Beautiful. Again, rising up and back. One more, gently rising 
up and back. Come in, grab that foot bar with the left hand, reach back, take that stretch, release down, pull that leg towards you, lift up. Two more. You can always use a strap if you need to, or you can always keep the leg simply bent and not grab anything. And gently rise up, switch to the other side, grab and go towards the well. And then gently rise up and again, going down and up. Beautiful. One more. And gently release, reach back both legs. If you can grab, take a final grab and gently release. Lower the legs down. Good job, guys.